Hey everyone, I am Carlotta Champagne. Today we are going to be doing a belt try on haul. It has a question mark after it, like maybe you're not. <laughs> Anything with a cat suit, you can do a lot of different looks with. I'm just making sure I'm not busting out because it seems like I am a little bit. We're starting with my favorite, my most valued, my championship belt that I won from Hulk Hogan himself. We've been hanging and banging, brother. Basically, Hulk Hogan owns a restaurant in Clearwater, Florida. Hulk Hogan's restaurant has a big singing competition every week, and they give a championship belt to the best female singer and the best male singer. So I slayed with Judas Priest breaking the law. I had this sexy raspy voice that day. I didn't know what was going on. It's pretty important, but this is probably my most valued belt and unfortunately it doesn't really fit me. It just stays in my game room now usually. Okay, so I have a lot of really wild and weird belts. I'm excited to get to them, show you all my funky fashion, 50 pounds of <laughs> for this try on haul. This is actually really freaking heavy. Are we ready? Let's do this. And we are back. This outfit is everything. I love it. It's got sort of fake coins here. And I guess you would say like feathers, sort of feathers and lightning bolts. It's edgy, it's fun, it flows, it moves. I picked this up at an estate sale. Most of my belts I end up picking up at estate sales unless, you know, Hulk Hogan gives them to me personally. Check it out. Also, I just have to point out this, this fab spider web on the back of the dress. And I suppose if I really wanted to, I could wear it up here too like a crown. <laughs> Let's go to the next. We're back. And my outfit is way more see-through than I realized, so sorry about that. But this belt is a riot. I picked it up at a swap meet. It's from the 60s. What I like about it is that it says hot. It has a question mark after it, like maybe you're not. <laughs> maybe it's not that hot, but let me know. Let me know what you're thinking. Do you think it's hot? Check it out. This one's kind of hard to wear, so I think I'm gonna go on to the next outfit. Are you guys ready? So I found the perfect outfit if we went through some sort of multiverse where instead of John Travolta in Greece, Olivia Newton-John actually ends up with Flava Flav. This is it, this is the outfit. This belt, it is vintage, it is fabulous. It needs new batteries, but it does actually function. It's really cool. It's basically a giant watch. Check it out. This outfit is so good for different belts. Anything with a cat suit, you can do a lot of different looks with. So I might even try one more, just, just since I have this, out, this one out. And I'd like to get in a fight with this. Like someone try to punch you right here, they're gonna break their hand. So that's clearly the point of these big belts is to injure people. <laughs> Pulling the belt up, like ready to go. <laughs> This is probably from the 80s. There's a lot of big belts. It feels very heavy metal. So check it out. And of course, don't forget, lots more on Patreon. So come follow me over there. But in the meantime, let's go to the next. And we are back. This is gonna be my last one. I'm just making sure I'm not busting out because it seems like I am a little bit. This is 90s to 60s. And it's got a lot of like that sexy 80s influence. It feels a little Kelly Bundy married with children. It also has this Fran Drescher feel. This belt, probably from the 80s, but it matched, so we're going with it. Check it out. And what I love about these big belts is most of them are made to fit several sizes. They have an elastic band, so they cinch you in the right place. They're comfortable. If the belt buckle is too big, it can actually be prohibitive from like bending over or moving. I still have so many more belts, so many more belts. So we're gonna do a part two. I will see you very soon, but in the meantime, check out all my links below, Patreon, Instagram, TikTok. Have a good one.